Hello friend. In this video, I want to show you how to allow your users to be able to edit only their own pages. With Advanced Access Manager, you can actually do it in three different ways. Um, so let's dive in. The first way is actually a free way. You don't have to buy a complete package, which is a premium add-on. And uh, it's simply by, uh, it simply can accomplish by using WordPress rolling capabilities. Okay, so here I have my test site. And if I go to pages, I created a four test pages, Andrew, Balthazar, Charlie, and Lucy, which correlates to four users that are editors, Andrew, Balthazar, Charlie, and Lucy. The idea uh, is that each user should be able to edit only their own page. All right, let's go to AM, and here I will create a new role and I will call it a uh, page manager. I will inherit settings from the editor role. I will explain you shortly why. And now when I go to capabilities, there are two things you need to know about uh, capabilities uh, in, in WordPress, especially edit pages. Edit pages capability uh, tells WordPress core to allow edit pages um, for users that has this capability. There is another capability which is called edit other pages. And that one is the one that we actually interested in because this one allows users who are not authors of the page to be able to edit those pages. So for the page manager, we will actually uncheck this. And uh, <clears throat> so what do I mean under page author? Uh, if you go to pages and you click on a quick edit, there is an author. So if say if you want for the Baltazar page um, to allow only Baltazar to edit this page, we just select them as an author. The same with Andrew, he has already pre-selected an author. Now um, the last thing that I need to do is just go to users. Select Andrew and assign him the page manager role. Here in Incognito, I'm logged in as Andrew. And if I refresh the page, you see, he can see uh, uh, only his own page because it's on mine and he can manage it. But if you go to all, all other pages are not allowed. So this is the way number one. The other way, is to utilize uh, Advanced Access Manager post and terms uh, service. Switch to page manager and let's go reselect, edit other pages. And I can show you that now um, Andrew can actually edit all the pages. On the post and terms, there is, we can set a default, uh, default access to all the pages if you have a complete package, which is a premium package. And we say this, we only allow, uh, we deny edit other pages. That's a, that's a setting. And right here, it's pretty much done the same. Uh, the last way how you can accomplish that is uh, simply by uh, the last way is actually when you do not want to uh, assign authors. Let's say sometimes you just want to say, um, you know what, I'm an admin. I want to have, I want to be an owner, an author of all the pages. However, I want to explicitly allow certain pages to my other users. So in this case, if you do not want mess with author uh, property. Uh, you can set the default access to all the pages by restricting editing. However, you know, if you see, if, if I go back as Andrew, uh, Andrew is no longer allowed to edit any pages. But then I'm going to go to Andrew explicitly, drill down to pages. And now it will overwrite the restriction and allow. 
And now if I go back to Andrew, and now I can actually edit a page as Andrew. So this is three different ways to, uh, for you to uh, allow managing only uh, user-specific pages. Um, so thank you very much for watching the video. Bye-bye.